Hi there, I am Dara Lagafmo. This is the third video in our series of UWP controls. In this video, I will show you the grid view as opposed to the list view as we did in the previous video. Alright, so I guess we can get started. Uh, you can get the code sample on this link, aka okay, just ms slash UWP grid view. Alright, so let's get started. Okay, so a good example of an app that shows the use of the grid view is the group music application. Uh, you can see you have different uh, artists. So this is, I'll get this as a list view. Uh, so when I go back, you can see different grids showing different artists. I think it's a bit same here. I think this is a combination of a list view and a grid view. All right, and it's a jump list, you can jump from artist to artist. So, example of the grid is I'll show how it looks like in code. All right, so this is the code I have, uh, just like I did in the previous video, just uh, simple as that, you define the grid view and you name it, and then you set the data template. Now, I am putting the images and text above each other, so I have the image, the text block, and the, the, the picture, the name of the user, and the phone number all right so i have them stacked up in the panel vertically below each other so uh just as i did in the last uh video i have my data model of employee name phone number and string and then i have the view model which in turn is marked look five times today all right so and then in the back end of my main page i have the code that uh Get set the employee list to the grid view. All right, so let's see how that looks like. Remember, you can get the code sample at aka.ms slash UWP grid view. All right, so this is how the application would look like on my mobile phone. You can see as opposed to the uh, list view application. So this is the grid view. So I will just run this on my local machine. I deploy it to my local machine, right? So I'll deploy it to my local machine while well, I show us the grid view on the monitor and the list view on my local machine. I hope that will work. All right. So it's finished uh, deploying, right? So I'll set for list view in my list of applications. Okay. All right. So we can see the difference now between the list view, the normal application. I'll just grab this a little bit so it looks a bit more like our phone. So you can see there's the grid view on the right and the list view on the left. So you can see the different adaptations you can use for it. And most times it's uh, advisable to use the list view on the phone since there's not much screen real estate and then use the grid view on the system on the uh, mobile PC family of devices. All right. So I guess this video was informative enough. Please stay tuned for the next series. Thank you very much.